Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new Adobe XD tutorial. I made this design for you guys and I'll show you how to make this type of home page of the web. So let's start the tutorial. If you are new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. So I took here the artboard size is 1920 and like here 1080. So select over here, you'll get another page of that. So I'll show you how to make this one accordingly. That's why I just keep this one. At first, uh, let's analyze this one at first. Uh, then you'll get the way how to make this one. So here is the search bar. Here the menu bar. And here the side menu bar. And the title and some write-ups. And here some buttons. Which is uh, the pre-order. It could be like form or other stuffs. Here some other uh, vehicles and here which vehicles are showing over here that is the title over there and this one is the demo image and the background which is really transparency like uh, opacity five or six percent and here some photo which is uh, five or six percent and here logo here at first i'll insert the everything at first the background actually going to the square shape and drawing rectangle like this turn off the border give the fill color like this and after that i'll provide here the photo the background one so going to the file and import options from here i downloaded this one from website and provide you that website or photo download link in my video description so making it bigger okay that's good and the opacity that is six percent that's good okay now the yellow circle taking the circle over here turn off the turn off the border from here and give the fill color like uh, yellowish so i'll suggest you to give the color according to the car so how to uh, get the car going to the file again and import i downloaded png image and you can pick color from here so select this circle again and here is the color picker and you can pick color from here so that's it and place the car over here making it a little bit bigger if you need okay that's good and here is some work just because of um, uh, here i used another photo which is the background for this going to the file again and import from here i imported this photo so making this photo bigger bigger type of size like this that's good and sending this photo into the down layer that's good and then select this one ctrl c and then select this one that means two photo this one and this photo select these two photo and the shape mask with the shape that's good and now ctrl v and the another one and giving the opacity down like this that's good selecting these two things that means here is two shape except this one that means just keep these two things and making it group and it will help me out to send back okay that's fine so this one send it back okay that's good and you can make it bigger by pressing shift and making it a little bit big that's good and now i'll write down or give the menu over here the search button here is the plugins the icon for design you'll get the plugins from the plugins menu go to over there and search for design or icon for design these uh, plugins you can download so here i'll search the search bar okay making it a little bit smaller but i don't want to get the search bar like this i need this type of search bar so already got here making it a little bit bigger okay fine and now i'll make it smaller like this this search bar i'll place over there okay and accordingly i'll take the arrow key this one so here the right side here i just written here the right and i'll get this one okay that's fine taking this one actually placing over here and making it smaller 
like this place this one accordingly over here it should be the middle of the artboard so making it middle and making it smaller by pressing shift that's good now i'll just place the logo over here going to the file and import options i downloaded the logo from google.com and here you can just give the search like porsche car logo that's good give here the home and other stuff so taking the text the text size will be 30 that's good and home changing the color uh, here the black color okay that's good and it should be aligned with this so here that's good and now select the home options and here the replace grid and making it three menus and actually four menus or four items and giving the gap between all the stuff like that and now i'll change the text like here and actually ungroup the grid and then making it into proper alignment now making it group and select the search bar making those into proper alignment now in the uh, right side we got all the stuffs here i'm taking this one from here and these arrow key and other stuffs will be here okay uh, now this one the yellow beast and other stuffs uh, i'll write down over here so going to the text tool and here the yellow beast and here the line going to the line tool and drawing line here that's fine and the thickness will be three or four that's good uh, i think four is good choose color from here yeah that's fine and now the demo text so i just uh given the copy from here uh, the google and giving the demo text here Control v and giving the font size like 21 and here the gap between two lines 22 that's good and the color will be white that's fine now those are bold font now i'll make this one light font going to here or medium is good that's good and here the button going to the rectangle tool making the button according to this giving the button color turn off the border giving the button color from yellow and giving the text so text size pre-order or this type of text and making it a little bit bigger place over here and select these two things that means the text and the box make them into proper alignment and pre-order this write-up will be uh, bold and color will be black okay again due to the changing of the font size you should make this one alignment again okay nice and now some grids and cards over here so uh, drawing some rectangle here actually like this it should be like that okay and alter option button and copy those things that's fine it will be a little bit over there and car placement into upper side that's good and now uh, i'll import photo i downloaded that photo from internet and i'll provide you that download link in my video description and this text and those will be proper alignment that's fine and here uh, the arrow key i will copy the arrow key by pressing alter option button and giving the arrow color into like black actually yellow not black so select this one and making the placement into middle that's fine now import the photos going to the file and import options from here i will import the side photo of the Porsche car and making it here sending it to back of the layer okay that's fine and making it a little bit smaller and select this shape and this one and make mask in the shape okay 
double click and you can adjust the shape of this car according to this so that's fine and now this portion going to the file and import now the font site and import and making it like this sending it to back of the shape and making it mask with the shape that's fine and make the alignment into middle that's fine and here going to the file and import options the dashboard and import now making it smaller that's good send it back and mask with the shape that's good and now i'll draw another rectangle over here turn off the fill color giving the border according to the yellow color here and border thickness 3 is good now make the border according to the previous shape that fine that means when the mouse hover over there and this yellow line will go to the other sides that's the reason to do that okay that's good now upper side will give the lines so draw the lines two lines will appear for the menu and taking the color from here and thickness 5 and press alter option button and make another copy of this so all the stuff we completed here so you're getting all the stuffs or do like that so you can make these things into a little bit upper side it will give some breathing space to this okay and this one little bit upper side that's good you're getting the home page so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section and until the next video i am signing out today stay safe stay at home keep me in your prayers as well bye bye